Students at Preble High School were assigned to make a video for a digital media class, which they did. But a few of the students shot some extra footage, which then made its way onto the Internet. And as Shelly Bota tells us tonight, those students learned the hard way that what they post can be seen by anyone. Warning. Not suitable for all audiences. And it certainly isn't. The video is called Mexicans at Preble and is posted on YouTube. It was created by five sophomores at Preble. One part depicts a border crossing, and the students pose this question. What do people at Preble think of illegal Mexicans? Principal Chris Wagner says the students were assigned to make a video for their digital media class. They were allowed to use school equipment and could tape at school. But they also made a special version for the web. I truly don't feel the youngsters involved were racist. However, that said, you look at it, it could certainly be interpreted as being racist. Uh, and uh, for that reason alone, it's, it's inappropriate, besides some of the other uh, footage in there that's definitely in, inappropriate. School officials believe the students were just trying to be funny. In fact, one of the video makers is Hispanic. What you have sometimes with, with youngsters, they'll do things without thinking. Uh, and to an adult, it may come across as being pretty darn silly or inappropriate. To them, they think they're being funny or cool. Smells like burritos, boys. Let's get them. School officials want this to be an example to all students. What you post on video sharing sites can be seen by anyone and can hurt your future. Once that's out in a cyberspace, it's hard to retrieve. And I do know, in fact, that colleges and many employers will go to YouTube as part of their screening process. Principal Wagner says the students did turn in their project minus the offensive video and are passing the class. <laughs> Shelley Botak, Channel 5 News, Green Bay. Now the school district has contacted YouTube and is trying to get the video removed. Principal Wagner says there were consequences for those students and their actions and their parents were notified.